my channel so uh, this is a new channel in which i would be telling you everything about abacus so uh, today i will introduce you to the abacus so let's get started So this is an abacus in which we will be learning how to do it. So this is a normal abacus. First we will learn how to set the abacus. So to set the abacus, first when your abacus is fully messed up, what to do now? Just pull your abacus up, put it down again and all the beads of the upper layer are down. Now how to make them fix? Take your two fingers, the index and the thumb. Use them to place it between the rod and then just pull your fingers up. This is as easy as that. So you can set your abacus very easily. Now we will visualize numbers in an abacus. I mean we will learn how to see numbers in the abacus. So this is basically one. Now actually I am considered this thing. I am considering this as one's place. So this is one. But whenever you consider any other dot, th suppose if you are considering this dot, the one will be here. Now this is one's, one's place. Now the left, I mean the left row, I mean this column is considered as tenths. If you consider this as ones, then this is tenths and so on. So now, first of all, we'll start with one's place. So now we will start the visualization of numbers. This is one, this is two, three, four, and the upper bit is five. So this is considered as five. This is six, seven, eight, and nine. Now you might be asking, what is what about 10? So 10 is basically 1 and 0. So to consider 1 and 0, in the 10th place we will put 1 bead up. Now we will remove all the beads in one one's place. So this is a 0. So 1 and 0 which is basically 10. So friends that's it for today's video. Hope you liked it. And this time we learned only numbers till 10 but in the next video i will see you with higher numbers so as you can see abacus is so easy and by the end we will do calculations faster than the calculator